Welcome everybody, I'm Francesca Ragno. And I'm Jeffrey Winterstein. For Revin Insider. So we reached the third and last day here in Aachen for the All Nations Cup 2019. What a day, we are obviously at the end of the day, we enjoyed such an amazing championship. So Jeffrey, I guess today we just want to talk about horses, we want to talk about the results and we want to share what we live today. Absolutely, let's start with the yearling fillies. It was a really exciting class. HTML Bella Chow with Frank Sponley for Ajman took it. She's just a beautiful sculpted head. I really like this filly going forward and looking at Paris. I think it's going to be, you know, this is the stepping stone for Paris and so we're going to see what happens. But gold here in Aachen, I think that's the important thing. And the silver and the bronze, Francesca? The silver medal went to Fam Donatella, proudly owned by Alja Weierstadt. She was bronze champion in Dubai this year. She came here in Aachen. She achieved the silver medal. That's a wonderful success and I wish all the best to this beautiful filly. She reminds me a little bit of Donna Montobella, I have to say. She has this amazing look. I really enjoyed looking at her showing. And the bronze medal went to Adra Al Arab, beautiful presented by Philippe Ose. She was the gold yearling filly this year in Al Khalidia. So she also made a wonderful journey and we wish all the best to her as well. Let's go into the junior filly championship. Let's move on to the junior fillies. Francesca, I must say, it didn't, wasn't really a shock to me who, who took the gold here in Aachen. No, the gold went to Algamra, proudly owned by Al Sheikstad, a very beautiful and tough championship, we have to say, but her stand-up with Rafael Curti was just impressive and took the heart from the judges. I have to say, also the silver medal was also very good and Artur Nascimento made the life of Rafael quite hard because the stand-up of El Er Era de Excalibur, proudly owned from Al Sayedstad, was very, very beautiful. And of course you may remember she was the yearling gold champion filly in Paris a couple years ago. So she was absolutely fantastic for the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia for that and Al Sayed stud. And the bronze was a Vision MI. She jumped up, she was actually third in her section, but she got up there with Glenn Shokins to get the bronze. It was a great for Alba Dyer and the breeder Mullawa stud from Australia. So she's gonna be strong looking forward going into Paris as well. But let's jump now into one of the most beautiful moments of the day. This was the Mare Championship. Jeffrey was long time, I didn't see such a quality all just in the championship. The judges had a quite hard life to find uh, the gold, the silver and the bronze medal. The gold medal went to Qatar, to the beautiful Al Nasserstad. They are well known for all their beautiful, amazing collection of mares. And this time, the winner was Meza Al Nasser, straight Egyptian mare. She was just feminine, very good looking, very elegant. I think she deserved, and she was unanimous champion. Let's talk about the silver. Right behind Meza Al Nasser was the two Polish mares, Alsa, Bred by Jana Pulaski, of course, owned by Ajman Stud, was absolutely fantastic. She's a bay, so it was a little bit different of a look from all those beautiful gray mares. But Frank did an absolutely fantastic job with her. She really looked the part. And so it, I think, sure, it was quite a battle between those. And then in the bronze medal, and honestly, if you could have, it could have gone any way but Bill Donut with Raphael Curdy for Al Sheikh Stud. Bred, of course, by Mihal Stud. She was fantastic. Moving on to the males, we start with the yearling Colts. A little bit of a surprise in that this Colt was second in his section, but Dosa Al Sayed, who was bronze in Menton, took the gold for Al Sayed stud, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. I'm really delighted for Khaled Al Sayed because he bought this filly from Brazil, the, the dam of Dorsa Al Sayed, the light diva from Brazil, and what a great selection there, and then it's paying off in the breeding barn too, so congratulations there. 
but the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia also achieved the silver medal here in the Erling Colts Championship. Il El Air Ferdinand bred by Tom Moven and now owned by Al Faisal Istad of His Highness Prince Faisal bin Saud bin Saud Al Saud. A beautiful show for him, he showed much better than in the class, in fact he moved better, the stand-up was just incredible, a huge su success for, for both of them. What about the third place? And the third place was Jasset K.A. from Clock Arabian, shown by Glenn Shokens, Rose Gray, great moving coat. I think he has a really bright future moving forward. He's a son of QR Mark and it's also very nice to see European breeders succeeding here in Aachen. Let's talk about the Junior Colt Championship. The gold medal went this time to Kuwait, to Al Kashabstad, proud owner of EKS Flash. He was bred in South Africa by El Kazun Arabians. He just moved incredible. He showed very well. The stand up with Glenn Shokens was very good, so he absolutely deserved the gold medal. What about the silver? Silver, he keeps getting a piece of it. HL El Ganador, the Chilean bred, owned by Hanai Stad in Switzerland, was the silver. Fantastic with Frank Sponley. I mean, this colt is going to be tough to beat in Paris. He's always in it. It's going to be a tight competition as it was today. It was very, very close. Everybody was wondering who, who would have got the gold and the silver medal. The bronze medal was achieved by Greece, by GM Arabians, proudly owned of D. Ibn Rashim, that was bred in Dubai by Dubai Arabian Stud. He's the son of the well known FAL Rashim one of the best producers that we have nowadays. He also performed very well, so big congratulations to all of them. But let's jump now into the Stallion Championship. The Grand Master Shanghai EA bred for Equus Arabians in Spain, obviously with Ajman Stad and Frank Sponley together again in the ring in Aachen. It was magic, gold champion. Really the crowd favorite, I thought. Everybody was waiting to see him again in the ring. We enjoyed him in Menton. We are enjoying it here now in Aachen. And I guess he's going for the Triple Crown title as he was bred in Spain and he can actually achieve it. The silver medal of the Stallion Championship went to Shadi Alcaledia. He was just playing in the ring. He was bred at Alcaledia Stables in Riyadh. What about the bronze? And the bronze, Atias O. Bred in the U.S., he went to Poland and now he's owned by Josh Studd. Fantastic for him. Actually, Paweł Kawakowski was the original handler, but he had another stallion and so Paolo Capecci took over and he did a great job. the end of the show we are really happy to have been here in Aachen again. We would like to thank you a lot uh, our sponsor of the TV show Ajmanstad, Anayastad and Akmanstad and also to the organizer to allow us to be here and give the opportunity to live such an amazing show. So I'm Francesca Ragno and I'm Jeffrey Winterstein for Raven Insider. See you next!